We are here. I'm just making sure we got both things up and running and then we'll get going. Um, actually, I have no things up and running. So that was actually kind of embarrassing because I'm saying let's get it up and running and then I'm realizing I don't even have it up yet on my computer for YouTube. So let's try that again. Oh, got it on the iPad. Boop, boop. Okay, one, check. Check with the checker who checks. Checks, waiting for comments. Hi, Roz, happy hump day. Okay, click on this one. Make sure my volume's off. It is. Woo, woo, I can see myself on both. Oh, I'm low, hang on. There we go. We'll just up that chair and pop up above things. Thank you, Rob. You're so sweet. Yay, thank you, Sharon. Okay. So we're going to play. We're going to butterfly brilliance at you guys. Thank you. Seriously. I think Corey said to me, you're going to go live on your birthday. I'm like, yeah, it's my birthday present to myself. I'm going on. You guys, uh, that's what makes me happy is you guys. <laughs> I need this. <laughs> Hi, Jan West. Yay. Okay. So peeps, um, butterfly brilliance is out and it's, it's brilliant. Can I say that? Is that super dorky? I want to make sure I can read both sets of comments. Can I turn this at the same time? No, I don't know. Oh, there. I think we kind of got it. Just want to make sure that I don't screw everything up. We're all good. Hi, Keisha. Thank you. Okay, so can I show you some? These were on my blog. I haven't posted them on Facebook yet. I did a uh, Butterfly Brilliance blog hop Woo! the other day. And so I'll show you some of the cute ones that I had done for that. So is that one there. Super sweet. Using the really pretty, the DSP that comes with it. And you can kind of see the butterflies and some of the dyes. Thank you, my loves. You guys are so sweet. Here's another one. Using up the bits. Love it. And then check out this one. Woo woo. Now, Butterfly Brilliance does not come with any sentiments. You get the stamp sets and there's dies and there's the gorgeous designer series paper. Stamp set and dies are carrying over to the annual catalog. Thank you, loves. But um, the DSPs are not. So like when you look at this and I've die cut that gorgeous butterfly straight from the DSP, these are the time limited part, right? Like we can't get all of those. I am patiently waiting for my butterfly suite to ship. I, are you really being patient? Cause I'm not patient. Hi Rob. How are you Robin Spink? I'm sorry, Rob. I could watch Cassian's dancing every day. It makes me so happy. It was like when he used to do his morning greetings. Just give me that every morning girl. Okay. So we're good. Can I move over? Let's see. Now I will, I promise, I know I need to take off my little hoozy wetsy thingy. So let's just click over here and then let's remove you. Boop, boop. Then let's head over here. Oh, we did it. I'm getting smooth with that peeps. You got to admit it, right? Like compared, compared to when we first started and I used to scream at the computer. I think I did a lot of screaming at the computer. Hi, Norma. You guys are so sweet. Okay, so let's, I'm just pulling out my sketch. I literally don't have anything out. And purely because I'm like, can I delay this and stay on as long as possible with you today? That's what I feel like doing. Now, I should probably get out my bin of my designer series paper. So just pause. Do you want to look at, look here, look and discuss. Oh shoot, my phone just told me it's on loads. Okay, it's all good. I have cords, everything is here and ready, so I don't even have to worry about this stuff anymore. We're pretty dialed that way. Okay, there, click, in, close, there we go. I'm hoping, did you lose me while I did that? I'm hoping not. Okay, so we've got that. Now, um, I'm just gonna move you, Yo, you can stay where you are. So I need to grab stuff here. I'm ordering a second set to do stamp. Okay, so what Susan's talking to you about, doing stamp surgery, Yes, but no butterflies will be harmed. Don't do what I did and do this weird job of putting on my label. Um, Susan's getting two of the set because it's actually a pretty reasonable set. You guys think it's 17 in the US and 23 in Canada. Yes, the charger is plugged into the wall, Trish. Um, but people are just surgically, like surgically, they're going in and they're cutting this bad boy apart so that they've got multiple sets. What up, Oregon friend? How are you? Okay, so you guys check that out. Discuss. Do you ever have teachers that did that? They put something up and they'd be like, okay, and discuss. I was like, I don't know what I'm discussing, but sure. So two of the papers that come in this like killer, 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 killer suite. We have got the natural touch specialty paper. Sorry, that makes me giggle. I don't know what it's the name. Sometimes I'm like, really? Apparently nobody hung out with 13 year olds when they were coming up with names. 
So I wish you could see this. I feel like I could make laminate flooring with it. So it's got this wood texture to it, but it's actually like I can I can feel the, the wood grain. Okay, so it's quite beautiful. You just get two of those. Thank you, Janet. Um, hi, you guys. Look at people from Pennsylvania. Party and Denise. So we've got that. I saw the animal print. Okay, but Keisha, I always see that after I throw stuff out. So Keisha is referring to, she said, do you see the animal print made from the bits of that stamp? It's pretty cool. So YouTube, I'm reading you the comment from Facebook so you both can see it. But what happened was when you pop out the stamp, you've got these little bits left. Don't throw them out. Mom wants to see your happy birthday face. My mom's on, guys. Should we come over and should we go tell my mom? Just a sec. So can, I'm going to go see my mommy, so say hi. Hi, mommy. There's my birthday face. Mommy, I'm wearing my, my Christmas dress that you gave me for my birthday today. I got all dolled up. And I promised my hair was less fuzzy when I went to work. Okay. Let's jump back over. And mom and dad were skiing again today, partying. I know, look at Mary Spicer. She's like, hi, Mom Flora. They even know your name. Everybody's on it. So I've got this gorgeous DSP. Someone used blends on them. That's fun. Um, I have to focus for two seconds because, like, let's be honest, my brain capacity at this point in the day, it's limited. So I can't talk and do at the same time. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get just a regular old piece of basic white. I'm gonna talk louder because it really bothers people when my voice dies off when I come away from the table, but I can't really do much about it. Well, I could. I could be more organized, but guess what? I am not, and I'm not going to be sorry for it. I need more hours in the day. Okay, so here we go. Hi, Carrie Cole, thank you. Hi, Pauline. Oh, I love this. Mom wants to see, I know, she's pretty cute. So we've got that one there. Now, next thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna cut a piece of this right down, or is it happy birthday? It is a happy birthday. They say it's your birthday. It's totally like hardwood floors. I'm gonna do a four by five and a quarter, okay? That's what I'm going with here. I, I'm not sure what the connection was between the wood and the butterflies, but it works, like it's pretty. So just a sec. I feel like if I saw a butterfly on wood, that it might not necessarily be alive anymore. There we go. Okay, so we've got it. Ta -da. What are you doing with the stamp bits? Oh, I'm not doing it. People made animal prints with them. Super cute. Like it was actually pretty amazing what people did with them. Okay, so I'm just making sure I've got all my stuff up here. Perfect. Okay, so we have got that on here. Now, what I did today, because I wanted to do a Facebook Live desperately, but I knew there was no pre-creating, procreate, don't procreate, pre-create, pre-creating time. Yay, Janet. Um, but I wanted to do, so I found a sketch and I was like, okay, good. I can work faster with a sketch than I can creating from nothing. So the first thing that we're going to need to do is I, and I'm really going to have to find some contrasting colors to use with the wood, at least for me, it doesn't kind of flow as easily. So I think I'm going to take this guy. It says it should be three and three quarters by one and a half. Remember when you say quarters that you gotta use. Oh, I'm using the 12 by 12 DSP, baby. Okay, so what did I just say? Three and three quarters by one and a half. Where's my little cutter? Can we do that? Let's do it. Hi, Fawn. Yes, I'm having a great day. My kids at school were so cute today. Okay, one and a half. Uh, there is two, one and three quarters, one and a half, okay. Do, do, one and a half, three and three quarters. We're doing it. Melissa Roberts, here we go. Oh no, what's happening with Melissa Roberts? They wanted us to get excited to buy the paper, so they threw it in. <laughs> they totally did. They're like, get this paper. It's not going to match with the butterflies, but get it. But I'm going to make it work. Oh yes, yes, yes. Good. That's what we're doing with the stamp bits. So cute. Oh yeah, mommy, you've met Sharon. I love it. Okay, so this one's gonna come in here and he's gonna have his end or she or they. All depends on what you want. Hi, Clara. Oh, and Denise, you guys are so sweet. I need to grab tailored tag. There it is. Hi, Aline. I'm gonna flag the end of this one. And Jada, oh, you guys, you make me so happy. It's like a birthday party. As close as we're getting to birthday parties at this stage, Pete. I said, my husband and I were laughing. I was the last family birthday last year that we had. 
Jack, this paper here is the one that comes, you can order with the Butterfly Brilliance Bundle, okay? Oh, good girl. Okay, so we have got this darling here is gonna come across like this, we got. Now, the next piece, I need a two and a half inch by two and a half inch square. I'm giggling because Clara has retracted her message. Those things kill me when it says that. Retraction! Okay, so what did I just say? I already forgot. I had to go plug in the device. Well, Catherine, don't you worry. I had to plug it in too. Are you talking about the bundle? Good. Okay, so two and a half by two and a half. So we need to pick, thanks, Cher, uh, another piece of paper to throw in a bit more color. Yeah. Okay. I, I mean, I love the butterflies. I don't think I want that one. So just a sec. So, oh, if you ever tried to put these back in when you're in a rush, it doesn't work, just so you know. Okay, so you guys can stay out for a sec. Let's check what else we got. So, you guys are beautiful. We could throw on a print, just like our big print. And I do love this print. I don't know why I love it so much. Like, it's such a pretty one. I think it'll work. Uh, or I could go, I could do you. Uh, I'm going to just stick with this one. Okay, so two and a half by two and a half. Okay, now we're going to have to, hi, Kim. Sorry, paper distracted me. I, Jacqueline, I am with you. Paper always distracts me. There we go. Okay, so we got two and a half. Oh, I've got a new person that it's loving today. Do you want to guess if it's you? By two and a half. Okay. Thanks, now. So that guy's going to go in like comme ça, just like that. That works. I'm liking it. Okay, now the next thing I need to do a three quarters of an inch by four. So if you're just joining us now, I'm literally like just pulling stuff out. So I found a card sketch. I like it. It's cute. So now I'm just trying to find my bits to put in with it. Okay, so I've used you. Can't use you. Um, I don't really want to use any butterflies because I feel like that. What if I put a text? Well, I got some texture in the wood. Mm -mm. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Okay, I could put in. We could take. Hmm. I'm trying to figure this out. Eileen, thank you. Okay. I could throw him in, but I don't feel like it's the right one. I feel like I might actually need a solid piece of paper there. So let's try a three quarter by four inch. We're used, maybe I'm gonna try a piece of mint macon, just because it's in there already, right? Like I wanna kind of stick to what we got. Okay, what are you? Oh, I got lots of paper kicking around over here. Is that the right color? I think that's it, hang on. I can get, I gotta get the measurements here. Three quarters. And then what did I just say? I lost my mind there, by four. Hi, Shelly, it's my birthday. I know, we're partying. Um, my kids at school, as I said though, they said I'm old, but as long as I keep acting young, we're good. That's what they told me today. So this guy, I'm gonna take him in here. Now for me, I start to need mats, like I can see that. Oh no, what are we seeing here? Good to see. No, our CMP needs to be contacted. I don't even want to know what you two were talking about today. So I start seeing, just for me, I need a mat for this piece because he doesn't pop right to me yet. Um, yes, order the paper now. It's not going to be in the catalog. Yes, 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 yes. You do need to order now. You got it. Uh, so what was our colors? Something shiny. Oh my God, I love it. Seriously, one of you, you are watching me today. Bermuda Bay. Okay, so let's get a little bit of Bermuda Bay. I thought it was Bermuda Bay, but then I'm always terrified to do one of my, like, it's Bermuda Bay, and then someone's like, no, no, Ange, it's not. Try reading. I don't always read. Oh, wait, I never read instructions. Where's my Bermuda Bay bag? Anyone know? I can find everything but my Bermuda Bay bag. Whoop! Apparently I can even find those. Oh, you're not it. We have no... Well, there is Bermuda Bay somewhere in the cupboard, but apparently I did not put it away properly. So I'm going to grab myself. I've just got a piece of Bermuda Bay, and I'm going to get um, two and five eighths by two and five eighths. And I'm not just randomly pulling numbers out of my wazoo here, guys. So what's happening is um, I just take the measurement of whatever I have, which is a two and a half by two and a half, and then I up it by an eighth of an inch, okay? So that's where that got, yeah, see, there. Do you, are you picking up what I'm putting down? Do you see how much better that pops? Okay, you're pretty, loving it. Okay, next. I feel like when I say happy birthday to me, I should be saying to my mom too, right? 
Now, this darling here, he needs something. I'm gonna give him a mat, and then I think we might emboss him. Are you in? Mm -mm. Bye. So now I went seven eighths by four and an eighth, okay? You, I know, isn't it funny? Just, you gotta give it that little, that little zhuzh. Nice, okay. So this guy's gonna come in here, but again, I'm going to, I wanna give that some texture. Can we pick a texture? You know what I was thinking with that pattern? Hold that thought, everybody. Happy day, Flora. I know, it's, mom, it's like it's mom's birthday baby. Um, but I was a second child, so you know, by the time you hit the second, you're like, you know, get it out. Okay, so we could do that one. That one's quite cute. Can't remember the name of it was. I've got nothing today. It's much to know. I, I am one of those girls, Kathleen. I'm totally good with people knowing my age. I am 46 years old. I turned 46 today. I act like I'm 12 and I don't care. Okay, so I'm thinking, what if we emboss our mint with this, give it a bit of texture, and then have it kind of pop onto here. I liked the look of those kind of splotches with the splotches in the background. Are you picking up what I'm putting down? So, let's lose you. Push my mess further to the side so that you can't see it. Okay, all done. Thank you, Feline. Much better. I know. Shelly, don't you agree? It just needed that little pop, right? Like it's just kind of got to give it I'm a baby. I know. Well, apparently I act like one. Hammered metal. Good job, Diana. Love you. Husband was in my craft room today. I'm not joking you. I'm being totally serious. But because he was cutting, um, you can't be on 39. Will you look 39, mom? My mom does. She's got that, like, you know that perfect skin? My mom's got it. She doesn't have wrinkles. She's, yeah, it's kind of annoying. Okay, here we go. Let's come in here. And we're going to go like this. Let's do it. Oh my God, Lisa Brigger, you posted the photo today. You guys, if you haven't, Lisa Brigger posted a photo of her and I. We were in Vegas when we took it. It's super funny. You couldn't be my grandma, Pauline. Don't say that. Um, but I giggle because... This photo that Lisa and I took in Vegas, we were leaning back. It was the one, oh, I think I told you guys about this. Here, I'm gonna, I, can I come back to me for a second? Am I allowed to do this? Okay, so let's see. I'll see if I can show you. I can't show you the photo right now, but I'll show you what we were doing. So we're in Vegas, a bunch of us, for a Stampin' Up! thing. And we're laughing about our, you know, our age and the fact that everything's starting to shift. So what my kids at school think this one's hysterical. So here's my face. Yeah, here's my face. In case you didn't know, this is my face. But watch this. You want to see me take 10 years off or five years? Watch. Boop. Just pull those little, my lovely jowl lines right out. So we're at this thing in Vegas and we realize that if you take your photo, I kid you not, you got to try this, do a selfie like this and you lean back you're 73? Well, you're not, can't be my grandma. My parents are the same age as you, you cute girl, Pauline. Now, if I take my selfie though, and I lean, look what gravity does. Everything falls backwards. So if you want to take a selfie, lean back and everything just goes naturally with gravity and all your wrinkles disappear. The only problem is you really got to make sure what you're taking the picture over looks like an upright and it doesn't look like you're lying down because then it looks weird, right? So yes, it was Lisa and I trying very hard to get our wrinkles to disappear in the photo. It was pretty cute. Okay, there we go. So we got that. Now, do we, we did emboss this. We're done. Okay. So I like this hammered look, peeps. Let's get hammered. Says the girl who doesn't drink. There. Okay, we're going like this dumping this one over sorry there we looked wrinkleless it was it was very satisfying wasn't it okay see that works to me it needed that extra little like pop and then we were good um it looked naked hanging out there on its own it was just doing odd things so we've got that one all in there we're tucked in we're good okay now this is where i want to go into my butterflies the story gets it dead but it was funny i wish you could have been there Seriously, to see us all in this restaurant, and I'm not talking one or two of us. I'm talking like 20 of us all leaning backwards, taking selfies. We look like major dorks. It was awesome. Now, I can come in. I've already got, look at, I've already got this guy stamped and die cut. Oh, no, I don't. He's missing a leg. He got chopped. Okay. I threw them back in the thing because, look at, I want you to see this. 
when you're doing a card like this, right, it doesn't matter if you've got pieces that have chopped because you can use them against the edge of your card. So don't get rid of that. Froze again. I'm a hoot. Oh no. What did I do? Re-raise the camera by the head. Tilt down. Yeah, man. Just looking up. You got it. It was a Heather Deer. Seriously, my stomach hurt that night. I don't think I've laughed that hard in a long time. Okay. So we have got it to here. I feel like I want to use a little bit of blends in mine or we can totally die cut. So let's look. The food was terrible and I think we waited three hours to get it. Oh God, that food was so bad. Um, we've got this guy who's quite stunning. I have to admit though, there's part of me that's way more partial to this shape of butterfly. Does anyone, is that anyone else or is it just me? You love it. Thank you, Paula. Paula, I think you were my first happy birthday wish and it came through even last night. You were so cute. Oh, Patty, I'm so glad to see you on here. Yay. Oh yeah, I'm sure they've seen Stranger Things in Vegas for sure. Okay, so should we do a stamped one and then cut it? Let's do that. Okay, I need ink and we need, I'm using a Stamposaurus with this. If you don't have a Stamposaurus, it's not actually called that. Oh, mom, I don't know if you're still on. I have one of these for you. You might find this very satisfying, mother. I do have a backup one for you. Now that I can't hold classes in my basement, I have a lot of extra things. It's freezing on your end. It could be because I did the flip back and forth. I don't know. Okay, so got that. And I'm gonna take this guy and we're gonna put him down here. Foop, foop. Yeah, hi Amy Todd. Oh, we don't need that thing in there, get rid of it. And mom's like, yeah, I know. Mom's like, this is awesome. You keep not being able to have classes. My mom gets set up. Hi, Kim. Okay, so we've got that. Now I'm gonna need some of my white paper. Just a second. Giving it a chop. So mom, these are awesome because if you mess up, then you're able to re-stamp it, okay? So if you put the block on here, I ink it up. They do have magnets on the bottom. Neither one of my parents have paste heart what's it called on everybody's good so I ink it up and then I stamp it it looks more butterfly -y. yes and I don't like moths moths freak me out ask my child about that my poor boy we had a, a moth I don't know how else to describe it a moth outbreak here in the fall and my son Joe was like damn dude like I'm not going outside this is insanity because anywhere you went you got you got mothed they were everywhere Okay, so here we go. You ready? We're gonna ink this guy up in our Memento ink. Now, I, I'm a twister. I'm only a twister with Memento just because of the style of ink pad. I don't twist. I'm a patter with like that with all my regular ink pads. Now, little trick. So Flo, if you're trying to get your ink on mom, go like this, stick an ink pad below, and it just holds that whole thing level while we're working, okay? Now, I'm sorry, because I know this does make my um, camera jiggle when I'm doing my my twisting and patting and thumping and whatever I'm doing. Okay. Oh, someone asked about the birthday cake. Oh, I have a birthday cake. My husband made it. It is called Crowning Glory. Mom, he made it. He did a killer job. I will take a picture tonight and I will post it for you. It's My mom, when she was in the hospital, when she had my sister, someone brought her when was it Canadian Living? Someone brought her a magazine and it had this cake in it and it was called Crowning Glory and then my aunt made it. Anyway, it became kind of a, like a birthday tradition in our house. And oh, I, look at how well I did that. Awesome sauce. Um, anyway, and then somehow even like husbands started taking it over. It jiggles just a little bit. Well, so do I at 46. <laughs> We're going to roll with that. That's okay. We can handle the jiggly bits, can't we? He is a good man. Yes. Okay. So next, I'm bringing in, it was a Women's Day magazine. Okay. Women's Day. Do we still have that magazine, Mom? Does that magazine exist? Not, not your one with your crowning glory, but does Women's Day still exist? I don't know. I'd have to read a magazine. Thank you, Mary Fudge. Thank you, Patty. Okay, so we've got this. Now we're gonna take our butterflies and we're gonna slap them down. Okay, now this is kind of handy. I am using my magnetic. I know we don't carry it anymore. 
you need to try the dry erase brush. I know. Well, I should just steal mine from my classroom. I don't actually use my dry erase brush in my classroom. I use a rag. It works way better on the whiteboards than that dry erase brush does. So I have one. Um, okay, so all I'm doing here is I'm doing kind of best. So you get them, because I mounted my stamp a little bit wonky, mine is never going to be perfect. It's my own fault, but that's okay. I'm just kind of going to get him set up. Now we need the clear plate. Oh yeah, Sean was cutting a gasket. I kid you not. On my cut and emboss machine today, he needed to die cut this cork gasket and he was trying to find, he's like, do you have a compass? And I'm like, what the heck for? I'm missing a plate, I can tell. Um, and Corey, you're supposed to remind me. And, um, sorry, I'm totally just lost my train of thought. Oh yes, he said, do you have a compass? And I was like, no, I don't have a compass. And he said, I need to cut a one in whatever, seven, eight, seven inch gasket. And so I was like, well, I do have circle punches. I've got, you know, one and three quarters. And I said, but my layering circles could actually be one. And, and sure enough, we were set. We had a one and seven eighths. Die cut Sean a gasket for some carburetor. Never knew your crafting stuff could turn into things for a mechanic. Okay, let's go through. I am not getting rid of these butterflies. I keep all of them. Every time I run this thing through. Do, do. There we go. Okay. So what perfect. Are you seeing those? We got all these butterflies. One shot. I do love that fact. I know people are like, I don't need them all together. I do. I'm that girl. Okay, now let's think of the colors that we want in this. We're gonna go big. Going with this little darling here. Okay. And then we can have we can set, throw a happy birthday sentiment on here. I will let us do that tonight. Um, Bermuda Bay, I'm thinking, and the mint. Anyone have a color that we want to throw in with Bermuda Bay and mint? What do you think? Okay, these guys, just a sec, because they're going to get annoying if I don't kind of start adhering some bits. So let's just put these bits with their buddies. Put your bits with the buddies. I must set. Oh, it is so cute. Again, it is making sure to let me know that one of you is watching. The funny part is, is I know when other people, when the person who's watching me leaves because then it changes to a new person. Now you're being quiet. Nobody's commenting. Is everything okay? Corey, can you say something? Because there's no comments anymore. They've all stopped. And it just keeps telling me over and over again that someone's watching. So Corey, if people are commenting, can you text me and be like, oh yeah, they're, they're commenting. You're just not getting them. Okay. Someone say something to me. Oh, there you go. Island Indigo. Ooh, I, I would, but do we we don't have Island Indigo anymore. I don't have my retired colors. What up, junk? Okay, so there we go. I'm the person who gets rid of her retired colors. Does anyone have any tips on getting engine oil off of a dog's fur? Oh, yeah, get rid of the dog. I'm just kidding. Don't do that. We love Tucker. Okay. What does Sean use? Sean uses something. Let me ask him. Ooh, Daffodil Delight could be very pretty. There we go. Dawn, nice. Just, yes, absolutely. Come on, it takes it off the birds. Is it me? It's not you. It is not you tonight, Trisha. Okay, so you're saying I'm pulling a yellow. Should I do a saffron -y? Should we do a soft yellow? We can, there's someone saying Calypso. We're gonna pull a couple of colors and then we'll see. Okay, so I am going to be doing my mint and my Bermuda. We're all still here. Okay, good. Scared me because I was like, I just kept telling me that the person was watching. Okay, so let's play with this then. Do we want one, two, three? That is actually quite pretty. Or one, two, three. Can you pick? Do we want Calypso with it or So Saffron with it? I can't go much brighter than that because it'll bug me. So Calypso, So Saffron, vote. Ooh, pool party or So Saffron. Pool party too. I'm a pool party girl. Yeah, pool party's quite beautiful there. I, I'm going to go, I love your idea there, Clara. Soft yellow. Okay, so I've got a yellow. So we've got one for saffron. One over here. I'm waiting. One calypso. One over here. I have to watch back and forth. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Oh, I know. Case, don't you like the layout? Calypso. Yellow. Yellow. Holy cow, my eyes are going back and forth. This hurts my head. Just a sec. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. 
Yellow. Yellow. Oh, yellow one. There we go. Okay. So we got it. Put those back. Don't put them down. Put them away, people. Okay, let's pull this guy out. Why do I have her over it? I was going to say, why do I have a red ink pad out? But it's from when I was stamping. Mom, you just got vetoed. Mom, we can make this one tomorrow night. Mom and I do stamping dates now on Thursday nights. And no, you're not invited. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's mom and me time. Um, but we do have our Facebook Live anyway tomorrow night. So we're all good. Okay. So what I'm going to do here is I'm actually, I'm going to start with my dark um, Bermuda Bay. And I'm going to kind of go in and work on a bit of his body there. You guys are still voting. I love it. I'm already moved on. I'm already coloring, but you can't see that yet. Message retracted. Okay, Deborah retracted her message. Those always make me giggle. Okay, so we come in here. Okay. I feel like we could probably throw Calypso in too. Now, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to start dark in here. And I'm going to kind of work that out along the shadow lines. Oh, my eyes just totally went cross-eyed. Sorry, I had to pause for a second there. I was like, oh, I can't focus. It's totally a mommy and me class. We should do that. We should get everybody on with mothers or daughters or aunts or sister. Like you had to grab a family member or a friend to be your buddy. We should do Stampin' with Buddies night. So mom and I call each other over FaceTime and do it, which is kind of fun. You lost out again. I always lose out. Diana, don't ever feel bad because I always lose out too. Okay, so I'm going to continue with my light Bermuda Bay and bring it up just into this zone. There we go. Love. Okay, and then I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull a couple little sections. We're going to kind of just pull that light all the way down. See, what do you do when a butterfly is not symmetrical? Like, what, dude, you're awful. Like, how can one side, how am I supposed to color you and make you look even? But I guess all things in nature, much like my ears and my eyes, they're not perfectly symmetrical. I lost out again. You guys are so cute. You're cracking me up. And can your mom adopt me? Then we could go together. Mom, do you want another one? No, she'll tell you I was enough. <laughs> I, have, uh, I have two teenage boys who are, they're amazing. They're angels. But my, I think my youngest is a, <laughs> I think my parents do giggle. Because I think he's a lot like I was at his age. He's a sweet boy, though. But yeah, he's more his mama. Okay. Come on. Am I running out on this one? I hate you that much. Ooh, you guys. Are you seeing the color kind of come to life in this? Mom, we need to do more coloring. That's what we need to do. Like with blends. I need to get you into them. Okay, so I'm going to come in with my So Saffron, my dark. Ooh, you are very wet. There we go. I kind of pull a little bit of color. Do you ever have that where the alcohol's kind of right there when you, I feel like I need to shake this guy a bit. Okay, so we're gonna give him a little bit of my dark. Go to my lighter. Looks great. I know I kind of, well, it's the coloring, right? The coloring makes me happy. That's the part I love. I'm gonna add a little bit in there just to kind of lighten him up. Thank you, Debbie. Yes, I've had a great day. I'm going to my other end. Ooh, I like it. Okay, do you feel like we could add some Calypso? Can we do it? Will anyone get mad at me if we throw it in too? You can't get mad at me. It's my birthday. <laughs> Can I play that card? Let's do it. Just watch. Okay, don't get mad. Someone's going to go like, oh, I hear someone's coming in. I don't know who it is. It's going to be someone. Child? I'm just doing a Facebook Live. Don't say anything rude. Oh, thank you, honey. Okay. That's a child that's reading, as I kept calling it, how to kill a mockingbird. It doesn't actually instruct you on how to kill the mockingbird. It's just to kill the mockingbird. And I'm hoping that eventually we'll get to where I find out why it's called that. I don't know yet. Oh, you guys, this looks good. Does shaking them do anything? I don't know. <laughs> I would look like an idiot doing it. Should I film myself? I heard a tip. If your markers are dripping, pull both ends off. Something to do with the pressure. That You know what? That makes sense though, right? If you don't know how to pull the tips off, you just use tweezers, guys, and it, you can pull them out. Okay, so I'm coming in here. Oh, I'm loving it. Bringing it in. Boop, boop. Working it to there. Okay. Uh, take you out. 
My mom and dad were skiing again today. Potty animals. Oh, you guys, this butterfly is gorgeous. Yeah, I know. I gave in. I was like, I, I couldn't figure out how I was going to make those colors kind of flow far enough. So then I, I, oh, he's very pretty. And you know what? It actually kind of looks cool with the wood grain in the back. Like it really pulls the color out of there. It kicked me off for a second. It kicked you off. It was like, no, you're done. Get off. It's such a good movie and book. Nice lessons. Okay, good. I like that. Um, I don't know how much the teenage boy is loving it at this stage. I think it's the English, right? In the sense that um, their English now is even so far removed from what I would have felt normal reading. Like they, their uh, vernacular, is that the right word? Whatever. They speak differently. And so the further back you go, the more uncomfortable it becomes for them to read because it doesn't sound like good English. No, I, Jacqueline, I, I did, this, this is where you're going to die here. I took like English, oops, my clips of corals dying. Um, I took English Lit 12. I didn't even just take English 12. I took English Lit. I never read it. Never read it in any of my other grades. I have a psychology degree with an English minor. And I still, like I never ever read um, To Kill a Mockingbird. Now, I have many times in my life heard references to Atticus Finch. And so that part was kind of like, hey, cool. I know who that is now. So I was able to make that connection. Um, but yeah, I'm having fun coloring. This is kind of nice. How did you spend your birthday? With, you know, 120 of my closest friends and coloring. So what? Oh, do you know what? A bunch of my kids made me gorgeous handmade cards that they brought to me today that I was like oh my mom made my birthday card woo woo yeah mom okay this bit of yellow is gonna it's gonna sneak in there we're, I know it doesn't kind of look right there but we're putting it in he's gonna be a little bit imperfect like everything else okay give you a little bit darker into here soft soft can you do anything if your tip seems dry? It's fairly new. Um, I don't, I've never, I color so much that mine would never surprise me if they're dry. Like when you say fairly new, are you talking like it was new and dried out right away? Then call Stampin' Up! Because they're super great about those kinds of things. Or call, I think you're a demo. But if you're not, call your demo who you ordered from. I do, I, I have to be very careful that I hear my clip because I have been known to not push the tip on far enough and the marker has started to dry out. But then when I put the marker on and left it for a few days, it kind of came back. So I don't know. Everyone should read. Yeah. Oh, there's a movie. Okay. Don't tell my child that until he's done. The Mockingbird comes to represent the idea of innocence. I understand. Yes. I'm seeing the part right now. So Scout and Jem are, are starting to have some differences of opinions on how they should carry on in their ways. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. But I, yeah, I'm not going to, I do, when my kids are reading a novel for school, I know it's dorky. I know they're in grade 10 and 11, but I do like to have read the book so that I can, you know what I mean? Like further the discussion and where they write their like lame responses. We can be like, okay, what else can you tell me? Um, did I get anything else exciting for you? But I did, I got this. Okay. You're going to laugh. This is super dorky. Well, I got money from like family and stuff like that um, because you can't see anyone. And then my husband even gave me some money because I want to buy a golf cart. <laughs> Don't laugh. I shouldn't say not a golf cart. I want to buy a golf car is what I want to buy. Super dorky. Um, and so I've been saving my money. Um, and so I got some fat, I got some great new Uggs because I killed my last ones. And so my husband, that was a surprise. I, he was, I had mentioned that they were looking a little bit sad. Whoops, I have to decline my sister's phone call. And, oh, you guys, it is very pretty. It's a beautiful kind of color. Um, anyway, I had mentioned to him that they were looking a bit sad. And so of course he listens and I had this beautiful new pair of cute Uggs for my birthday with little zippers on the side because they're as close as I can get humanly to wearing slippers all day long with my wool socks in my open windowed portable. There we go. Okay, so we've got some seal on there. We had to read a lot in school. I remember being upset. I love the book, Lord of the Flies. That was a good book, people. 
I often threaten to do that at school. I'm like, hey, if I just don't go back and supportable and I leave the children in there for the afternoon, is it a little bit like a Lord of the Flies episode? Is that what's going to happen in there? Misty Moonlight. Ooh. Oh, good. I'm definitely going to have to watch that. How nice do you... Okay. Do you keep the same both sides color? Yes. So these... I don't know. Yeah. I, I tried to. I'll we'll see. Now, I need my little card sketch picture back up just to see what I was planning. Okay. Let's put this one down. I remember reading Paradise Lost. Did anyone else read that? See, and that was the kind of stuff, like, I loved Paradise Lost. But then I hear other people, and they're like, you what? Like, that was torture. I don't know. It was good. I loved Paradise Lost. Here we go. I had to read some really weird stuff as part of English Lit. That is disturbing. We read Lord... Um, to kill him out, Huckleberry Finn. Yeah, like there's all those. Okay, so this dude is going on dimensionals. Where are they? Somebody's back down here. I heard the door. We've Sean's kept the dogs locked out right now because they they get in menace mode at this time of night because they want supper. But it is lousy having to read it to this book on tape. Oh. Okay. Off. I'm still on. I'm sorry. Still, they can't see you. Sean just panicked. Do you need me? You what? About 10 minutes? Is that okay? Okay. That was Sean. He totally panicked. Paradise lost. I know. It is good. Sean just panicked because he thought you could see him, so he totally backed out of the room super fast when I said I was still on. Have we been on a long time? Yeah, we've been on 45 minutes. Why is YouTube kicking you off tonight? It's not being very kind. I removed the nibs, poured in a little bit of rubbing alcohol, put the nib back in, shook the pen, left it 20. Nice job, Pauline. Very industrious. Okay, so this guy's going to come over here. He's going to get some dimensionals, top and bottom. Ah, uh, hello, my boys. How are you? Hey, do you remember how you remembered my birthday? Super dorky. I tell the kids they can't write on the third line of their birthday page every day that's like my rule no writing on the third line name date skip the third line and then title double underline in red and the kids are like why do we have to skip the third line I'm like because my birthday is on the third day of the third month and I own it oh yes looking good I am going to add a sentiment to mine so we're just going to you have to bear with me for two secs because we're going to throw a sentiment in here too too late. We saw Sean and know what you did. Is that the word it keeps telling me? So and so is watching. Oh, he just peeked in, I think, because he's worried about supper. Okay. Mom, he got the night off. Did you know that? Did he tell you? He doesn't tell me. He said he was a surprise. And I was like, well, Jim, do you have to leave for work? And I was pouting. And then he's like, I got the night covered. I'm home. Okay. Oh, I'm loving that. Now it does need some gems. It needs something. I'm going to go with, I'm going to go with maybe my, well, we'll see. It's just a sec. Let's pull out some stuff. Blend holders. Yes. I, I have mine in the Stampin' Up! Blend holders too. Absolutely. Back to your class. They don't remember. Oh, one to go. What does their page setup look like? Is it neat? Is it tidy? Um, okay. So where are we now? We need to add some, well, maybe we won't add a sentiment. I'm kind of liking it without it. We have, it's just a sec. So I don't want those because they're too light. I could absolutely use some black Mac dots. I feel like they would be gorgeous on here. I don't want opals. They're too light. I don't want pearls. No hearts. Okay, so you're out. Just a sec. I keep these all in like little funky bins. What have you got? I feel like you might have. Oh, playing with patterns. We've got the rosin dots. We've got some yellow and we've got some blue. We could use that. What's somebody saying? Uh, Al Purdy's a splitter. Last book I read three years ago. Oh, yes. Wink of Stella over the butterfly. Okay, I'm getting it. Clear. Don't get my gold one or my white one. The butterfly looks tropical. It's because that's what we want. You want the black? Lisa, it's funny. That was my go-to, too. Okay, so I'm not going to do the whole butterfly because I don't want to muddy things up at all. But I'm going to go in and I'm going to add, I don't know, some like, kind of like sparkly points I love it good call you guys that's why I make you come on with me there sorry I painted on my hand just in case I had picked up color I don't I hate that it, when I muddy up a color 
There we go. Sorry, my tongue's sticking out. I can't talk for a sec. Now, can you, are you getting that at all? It is quite beautiful. Black dots. Let's do it. We're going to go black dots. Okay. I don't always put a sen. I know. Don't you agree? Like, I think sometimes it's nice to not put a sentiment on. And then I can use it for, and I can add a sentiment for sure when I go to send a card if I need it. But sometimes it's nice just to have a card that doesn't say anything. Okay. Done. I'm going to go with black. I like those. And here we go. It really looks great. Thank you, Eileen. Okay. I don't know why it's kicking people off. Hi, Kimberly from New York. I would like to go to New York. That's on my bucket list. You know, I've never been to New York. It's somewhere I've always wanted to go. Going on. Mm -mm. Sorry, I'm just trying to... If you don't have a take a pick tool, peeps, get one. Because seriously, like, they're game changer, right? There. And... I can't let you line up. Nope, don't like that. Just a sec. Oh, don't like that. <laughs> Isn't that funny? I can't get the right. It doesn't it's not feeling correct yet? Do you have a sticker? Oh no, I don't. I left a glue dot behind. Just a sec. Uh, don't I don't want to waste that guy, so I'll just put a glue dot on him after. But I stuck the glue dot to my finger. Okay, I'm just trying to figure. Uh, I need a few more. Maybe I'll go smaller. Maybe that's what the problem is. Maybe that dude was too big for down there. So there. Oh, I took your glue. Dot. Note to self: Don't slide it once it's on the paper. Hi, Kimberly. Kim from North Van. Do you two know each other? Kim and Kim? That's fun. Okay, but I don't want you to look like you're lined up in a line. So you have to move over. Come down there. there. Oh, I'm liking it, you guys. It turned out cute. So sweet. Okay, so this is that stunning Butterfly Brilliance Bundle. Um, that we used. So we used both of those designer series papers. So that's the wood one that you can buy. Um, it's 90, 97. I feel like it's 97 for the whole thing. So 97 gets you the package of this DSP. It gets you the gorgeous package of the butterfly DSP, that six by six package. It gets you your stamps and it gets you your dies. Guess what else it gets you? It gets you the, um, what's it called? The creative project tutorial bundle free for me that's that one the seaside spray sorry the, the sand and sea one which is killer so it's free with any 75 dollar purchase for me right now okay now we need a birthday special what is our birthday special just a second i know what our birthday special is here you ready because i feel like there okay my loves so your birthday special because it's my birthday so you get a special happy birthday to you your birthday special, and it will be on, today is March the 3rd. Let's carry it through till Friday. So we're gonna go till March the 5th. We're gonna go till 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. If you purchase your Butterfly Brilliance Bundle, say that 10 times fast, baby, for me before then, using our current postcode, ta-da, wasn't that tricky? Um, you're gonna get to choose an embossing folder. I don't care which one. You're going to email me or you can add it to your order. If you're placing your order online, stick your embossing folder on it. And I will just e-transfer you back the cost of your embossing folder, as well as the shipping and taxes on it. You're not paying anything for that embossing folder, or you can place your order online and I will, you can just say, Ange, I would like you to order it for me and I will send it to you. So you get a free embossing folder of your choice. Oh, curly hair is out of control with your purchase I just thought, of the butterfly brilliance suite. You guys, thank you for spending my birthday with me. Um, someone, you know, I was saying to Corey, I'm like, I, I can't skip it tonight, not because I feel obligated to, but because this is my birthday present, is hanging out with you guys. It's kind of fun. Again, it brings me, it just lifts me up right now with everything that feels so heavy. So, mwah, have an amazing evening. Tomorrow is Thursday, and I will see you all tomorrow night, okay? Night, guys.